A Paralympian has called for there to be greater representation of black people on the boards of major sports in the UK. Wheelchair racer Anne Wafula Strike is the only black board member across Britain's 12 biggest sports. She works with UK Athletics. She's been talking to our sports correspondent, Laura Scott. Sport has been undergoing a period of self-examination, with some of our biggest stars speaking out about differences in opportunities and racial injustices in the wake of George Floyd's death. Many have highlighted the lack of ethnic diversity in the hierarchy of major sports, and for the only black board member, Anne Wafuda Strike, the situation is deflating. The statistics are just really appalling. They're, you know, they are shocking. It's... <laughs> So how come I'm the only black person, you know, on one of these big boards? It's, um, I think it just really shows that um, we really need to be doing something. Can you imagine all the black young people, even those ones who represent this country, when they look around these big boards, they cannot see any versions of themselves. What does this tell us as a, as a nation, as a country? In the 130 sports bodies funded by UK Sport and Sport England, the proportion of black, Asian and minority ethnic board members is around 5%. When you don't see anybody who's representing you or some, you know, somebody of your version, you sort of start to ask yourselves, are we so irrelevant? <laughs> you know, we need to have people who can be good mentors, you know, like people that uh, the, the, the black young people when they're growing up, they can look up to. Fula Strike, who was awarded an NBE for her disability campaigning, is not in favour of targets being introduced. Target does not mean anything. I think to me what is important is bringing the black people on board and giving them a voice or listening to them. Because otherwise we will end up with uh, so many black people sitting on boards but with silent voices. So, and then it ends up being a ticker box exercise. The NFL has changed its stance on athletes taking a knee to support the Black Lives Matter movement. And the displays of unity are likely to continue next week when the Premier League kicks off but athletes are looking to the corridors of power for progress. Laura Scott, BBC News.